Hello, everybody, and welcome to the OC Rocket League Ooh. tournament. We're just about to get into our first match. Once again, I am Matthias, also known as Matthias. I'm joined by Daniil Bederson McGee. That is true. I am Daniil, also known as Bederson McGee. And he is also is not lying about the fact that we're about to have an awesome Rocket League match lined up for you today. And guess what? We have a lot more Rocket League lined up for you today as well. We're going to have a whole day jam-packed full of Rocket League, aren't we, Matthias? Yeah, we have a lot of great games on store today. But what is going to be our first game? Would you like to introduce us? Of course, us? we have Christ the King Secondary School Billy Billy Esports. And we also have the Panthers from O. Oswood Township High School. Yeah, Osgood Township, a very competitive team. The Osgood Panthers looking to sneak their way to victory here. But before we get into that first game, what are you most excited to see here in this day full of Rocket League? Well, honestly, one of the things I'm most excited to see, something I've been seeing a lot already, and that's just the excitement and the energy that people are bringing to the arena. I know you and I were talking quite a bit, <laughs> but just like, wow, in high school, like we had nothing like this. Yeah, elementary no. school, especially not elementary school, you know, or middle school. Nothing to this degree of competition, camaraderie that you know, esports and any kind of competition brings out of you and your friends. I can only imagine how excited these kids are to be here to compete on the Saints stage. It's a, it's a really nice stage. Okay. Yeah, it is really nice. <laughs> and I would be so excited to be out there competing on that stage, and I'm excited to see what they do, how they perform. But you know, we don't really know all too much about these specific teams, you know, because oh, yeah. we more specialize in the collegiate space, but it's nice collegiate to see the, the new burgeoning talent out there. If you just had to guess, based on the names alone, who would you guess who takes this one? Um, well, I could guess better based off of the names. Uh, but instead of guessing, let's just completely <laughs> observe and just take a great look at this action as we're getting started billy billy gamers and the panthers were starting off hyper is now already making a rush for the net but it's gonna get saved out by iweezy now coming off the side into the center we have Hog or bognog rather i love these names already <laughs> you know i'm a big fan of cool gamer tags and we have some of them in space and i think my favorite team name is definitely so I like Frank My Fry. That one's pretty good. <laughs> but so far, these teams seem to be very evenly matched. We see that is as we going in there for a dunk into the net, but can't quite get it as Bash Weiss manages to save it out. Bash Weiss, an incredible name and an incredible player, I'm sure. This first game, I believe, is for Platinum in the low division, but Frank My Fry already started things off with a great goal. You can see the focus and the excitement on their faces as they're on the stage, but a great pass and an even greater shot coming out. First goal going towards the is it Bashweiss or is it V4 Chewies? I'm just now trying to decide. Bashweiss is definitely cooler. <laughs> it could be, but Chewies is also a great name as well. But looks like Aiden is going in and leading the charge with his team, and the Panthers are not letting up trying to get their goal. But a nice save from Billy Billy Gamers keeps them in the game. Yeah, w Aiden. Oh, just barely missing that save, but Hyper CPK making sure that one finds the net. We're already tied up in the series, three minutes remaining, and we are looking at one to one already these teams are looking fierce matthias and i can't wait to see what the rest of this game has in store exactly this is looking to be a very competitive game i'm excited to see who takes this first one see hyper going in leading the charge for his team looking for a setup of the defense is strong the panthers right now looks like they're not going to let up though the aggression is mounting here they didn't look to clear this goal along with his partner to do so, but it's right up there in the air. They need to get control of this ball. They managed to do so, but it's a chase as Hyper is looking to be a hyper aggressive and taking control. But they have a nice shot oh. set up, and W Aiden gets the long goal. W indeed, Aiden. What an excellent shot and a great follow up off of the aggression. I feel like what really makes it or breaks a team is their opportunity seeking potential that they have. Rocket League, especially as you get better, does not present you with a lot of opportunities. So any opportunity you get, you've got to take it and make the most of it. I think that was a great example. 
Exactly. I don't know if anyone's seen Demon Slayer, where you have to see that opening thread and go for that strike. And that is looking like a bog dog. I found that opening thread, and he went for it, making this score 2-2. Two to two. We love bog nog, and we love goals like this already. 2-2. Two to two. It's only been about 30 seconds since we were tied before, <laughs> and we are tied once more. This is just game one, ladies and gentlemen. These teams are being completely unstoppable so far. Now we're getting V4 Chewies trying to catch that ball mid-air, but Ozzy almost gonna catch that one. Gonna have to take that one to the net. However, it's gonna get centered up. No follow-up, however. It's gonna get taken to the corner. It's gonna be a little bit of a fight for it. Off of the post, almost. W Aiden sends that one to the center, tries to get it going forward, but we're gonna have the V4 Chewies take the pass to the corner. Aiden now and Frank for Fry, they're all just taking these shots. The defense is there, however, and Hyper is gonna be able to take it out, but he's gonna get demoed in the process. Who comes through, that might Another be an opportunity one. for them to strike. They can't quite make it there, but now they're not going to let up. They almost get it in. Just not quite. Now Aiden is going to be the one to take the lead here. Going to set up is going close. Oh and break by God. Fry. Sees the opening and dunks it in. Beautiful goal again. Well, thankfully, this one had a little bit more of a gap in time between the previous goal and this one. So 2-16, to 16, Billy Billy Gamers still has time to really try to find their next goal to tie it up if they have a chance of taking this first game. But I've been seeing the defense from the Panthers so far, and I gotta say, it's been pretty impressive, especially when those high-pressure moments really come together. I feel like their comps must be really good if they're able to kind of hold together and push through as a team. But, like I mentioned, their defense is solid, but their offense is as well. They're maintaining the pressure. W. Aiden taking the next shot, and his teammates already on the back line, ready to try to follow up on anything. It's going to get saved out, and it's going to get cleared. Frank for Fry, or Frank my Fry, just barely missing that one, but ready for the follow up, going for the shot. It's going to get saved by Hyper. A beautiful save, and right now it's back to the corner and right back to the center. But V4 Chewy says, absolutely not. Intercepts it and makes that a goal. Now, the Osgood Panthers are up 4-2 to two over CTKs. Exactly, and Osgood has a firm lead now. Billy Billy, though, has answered before. I wouldn't be surprised if we do see this get tied up once again. But with 1 minute 30 on the clock, it's going to be a tough ask. A tough ask, but not an impossible one. We've seen how many goals these teams can get in such a short amount of time. I wouldn't be surprised if Billy Billy Gamers were able to tie this one up. As you can see, Hyper already going for it, and Ozzy there to make it possible. The dream has come true, 4-3 to three all Ready. You can see Coach there trying to get the team ready, get the team focused up. I hope it's working because Billy Billy Gamers, they are doing excellently so far. I love that goal effect, by the way. I might have to pick that up myself. That was a nice synth wave yeah. goal effect there. Now there's still just a minute 20 left on the clock. This is not a lot of time, but there's a lot of time for Billy Billy to try and tie this one up. But Osgood wants to maintain their two full lead. They don't want to be in a position where this could go to an overtime game. Another goal right here, getting a set up off the backboard, trying to go for the dunk. The clear comes through for Billy Billy. Trying to gain control of the ball, but Osgood Panthers are not letting up on the aggression. Getting in front of the goal once again. It's going to just barely go back over to Hyper, and he's going to try to tie this one up for his team. And now you can see before Chewie is doing a great job of controlling the ball, taking from the center to over to Orange. But the blue team here, Panthers, they're trying to find it, take it into the net. It's going to get saved up by Ozzy, and they're now going to have to keep fighting to make this one go in. But thankfully, they have Frank My Fry just slowing it up a little bit to slow down the offense. But Billy Billy looking to turn it around and make this into a counterattack. All of the Panthers are ready for the defense, however. They have Hyper in the back line ready to try to pounce and they're gonna clear it take it right back over to blue side almost went over to orange billy billy they have 10 seconds to make something happen here do they have it a great save from bognog can they only take it over to the next side but halfway across the field frank my five tries to get one final goal it's not gonna get going but panthers are gonna secure game one and they secure the fist bump as well. <laughs> Not left hand, and you love to see that. Up here in the collegiate, sometimes we see the fist bump from left hand. All but you know, often. these kids, they have it on lock. They're ready, they're focused, they're a strong team. They'll never leave their teammates hanging. But like we were just talking about, Matthias, 
that's just game one underway and Already, I'm very impressed. This is the Platinum and Below division, but the gameplay that we're seeing is still very impressive all the way through. Yeah, very impressive gameplay all around. These teams very evenly matched, but Oscar mm -hmm. just barely overtaking that first game. But I'm excited to see how they adapt going into the next one. Billy Billy could maybe throw out some more tricks going into the next one, I bet. For sure. One thing I'm noticing, at least with these two teams, I wonder if the trend will continue along the rest of them. Um, the way that they're playing the offense and defense, there is just a lot more... Uh Skirmishing is the word yes. I'll go for. There's a lot more fighting for control of the ball at all points of the field. And uh, the teams also, also play a lot more connected. You don't really have people segmented too far. Oftentimes, you'll see at least one person in the back ready to get on the defensive side of things. But they're not afraid to kind of go all together, heat-seeking missiles, all chasing down exactly. the ball. You know? Yeah, impressive. they're like torpedoes flying through. <laughs> Sometimes they get the setup way far down on the net. Their teammate sees it hanging there. They're like, I'm going to use all my boosts, fly all the way through, <laughs> and get the slam into the net. So it's been some very exciting games so far. Or just game, I guess, singular, as we're going into our second game. I'm excited to see how this one shapes up. Shake it up indeed. Yet it completely shaken, so when you open it up, it fizzes, bubbles, and spills over. Not sure where I was going with that one, but we're gonna continue and take it through to this next game here. We have the Osgood Panthers versus Price the King Secondary School Billy Billy Gamers. And already 20 seconds, like I said, a lot of skirmishing, a lot of fighting. They want control of the ball and they're not afraid to fight and chase for it. We've seen some demos. Last game I think had two or three, and I wouldn't be surprised if we start seeing a lot more. In fact, there we go. There's we already one. got one and that's going to give it often uh, an open opportunity for that team to try to get more control but like i said we see the demo we see the goal not surprising the slightest the panthers starting strong we have strong start once again billy billy and this one very soon though got to give props to frank my fry he just finds these goals time and time again let's see how this the kickoff goes over to Billy Billy Gamers, but quickly regains control on the side of Osgood. He's still just hanging there in the middle. We're gonna see who takes control here. It's gonna be Osgood once again. They're so good at maintaining this pressure on their opponents. Two in the corner there. Now they're kind of finally spreading out, dispersing. Uh, before Chewie's there, back up W8 and Frank Mike Fry in the back line, ready to get that save. Taking it up now, Bognar chasing it, but Hyper is there to follow up as well. Off the corner, down towards the center. Can they get the goal? No, it's going to get intercepted. Ozzy's there to recover it, take it right back over to Blue and reset the offense. But W8 is going to intercept, clear it, and try to even get a goal here with support for Frank Mike Fry. It's going to get centered, but it's going to get cleared by Ozzy. This could even be a goal, but it's going to get Intercepted there was again Frank my fry ready to recover it but now Bognog taking it up to the ceiling it's gonna go down who's gonna find that that's gonna be hyper taking it right over to the net now popped up once more before Chewie's hyper or uh, yeah Ozzy's gonna be the one to chase this one out hyper in the corner now gonna have to skirmish and fight with Frank my fry a scary fight indeed but it's eventually gonna find its way to the center going straight towards the net hyper is gonna take this one out Frank my fry is gonna meet it there and once again Matthias it's just a lot of fighting for control. It's a, a lot of back and forth here, but this might be the finishing touch But for Billy Billy. They got a nice setup going with a clear. It's looking good from Panthers as well. Just to clear it up, but now it's still in that back and forth kind of limbo right now. Hyper trying to get a setup for the team going for it, and there it is. They get a nice shot on the goal, but it gets saved out by V4 Truce, but he fun. doesn't let up. Ozzy evening up the score line one to one. Neon Sun has risen once again over this game as Billy Billy Gamers picks up their next goal against the Panthers. I think they're starting to find their stride in this series. What they need to do is just make sure when they do have those opportunities to fight for control of the ball, they don't leave too many openings, and I think they're starting to recover that now. They are patching up their defense, and it's becoming really difficult now for the Panthers to try to find any openings as Billy Billy Gamers aren't giving them any. Not letting up in the slightest. They're already looking for that second goal, but now it's one and one. There's just continuing the aggression here. Looks like Billy Billy is just in total control of the ball currently. But Osgood not gonna let that go down without a fight. They get a beautiful setup here, but a beautiful clear is answered by Hyper. 
There is going for a run back there. The rebound is not going to land, but it's going to be okay. I see there's going to be more choices along the way. Going to pass it back to his teammates there. I respect that decision. It's better to give more control, even if it's closer to your side, than to kind of hope and pray that you're able to recover that while you're closer to the enemy team. But an aggressive play coming up from Hyper. It pays off just running down the defense, not having any care in the world, and it paid in dividends. As you can see, before she is not able to save that one, Hyper is going to get hyper aggressive on the offense and force that goal in. Now, kickoff has started. Osgood trying to get control of this ball here, but Hyper and the rest of Billy Billy Gamers are not going to let up off that pedal of gas. They are just continuing to drive this one home. I mean, look at Bognog, just pure aggression over here in the corner. Just an absolute brawl of Gars. They're going to have to back off, though. They want to try and keep control and keep on running out the clock on the Panthers. They're still going for these goals after goals after goals. I mean, look at that. Chewie's getting a nice save. Only Frank by Fry. They're not going to let another goal pass them just yet as they're trying to regain control of the ball and regain the lead in this game. But a nice save what is save. needed what right save. there. Yeah, what a save indeed, Matthias. Now, W8 and Frank by Fry Hyper, they're all chasing it. But a huge, that wasn't a demo, but it definitely felt like one. Ozzy just completely knocking the competition out of the park there. Frank my Fry is chasing. B42 is going to intercept now. Hyper clearing, but Frank my Fry run clearing that one, obfuscating, if anything. You can see the focus on the players' faces. Frank my Fry and Hyper off in a little bit of skirmish here, and W8 is going to be caught in the crossfire. Completely demoed, but Frank my Fry's patience paid off. Going for the goal, just going to miss the post, however, the W Aiden back in the game, refocused, trying to find something, but Ozzy's going to be there to block him. 30 seconds remaining. Panthers need to find one more goal to at least tie things up. Take it to wow. him, and they find it from cross field. An excellent play. It was left open, unfortunately, for Billy Gamers, but Panthers found the opportunity. They saw it, and they went for it completely and just had total faith in it. An excellent shot, and it worked out for them. And now, with 24 seconds left on the clock, unless one of these teams can break this stalemate, we're gonna be seeing our first potential overtime. But still, oh, it's my. Panthers going to the lead at the last moment. Yeah. But Matthias, as we always say in Rocket League, there are many last moments. 18 seconds, a lot can get done. But let's see if Billy Billy Gamers can find this opportunity to just cinch the victory out of the jaws of defeat. They have a reasonable amount of time to work with. I think they can just scrounge up the boost that they can, starve out Panthers for their own, and just get hyper aggressive. I think they can make something work here, but with five seconds remaining and more shots being taken, this is it. It's all or nothing here. One second remaining. Can they keep the dream alive? It's looking like they might be able to. It's almost going in, but V4 Chewie's with the save, and that's going to be it. The ball touches the ground, and Panthers are taking game two. They're taking a game two. I mean, very close victory. Billy Billy in the driver's seat for most of that game, but somehow Osgood Panthers managed to clutch it up near the end and take it all the way home. Yeah, Panthers just showing the resilience they have as a team. Like I mentioned before, I'm sure the comms are probably really solid. They're able to just make sure that they're filling each other's gaps. They're not leaving any uh, anything up to speculation. I'm sure they're all on the same page as well because you can see it in their play. Um, they're really coordinated and uh, playing as solid as a team can be. And I'm sure that Billy Billy Gamers are thinking of ways they can make that team synergy crack. Exactly, Frank my Fry gonna take initial control of the ball, bring it up high in the air. Someone looking to meet him there. Now Fortu is gonna get a nice shot on the goal, gets saved out by Bog Nog. And now, once again, this ball is flying high. Both these teams trying to get these aerial shots in here. Seeing something here, Aiden looking for the dunk, can't even get it, but now that's gonna leave an opening for Billy Billy, and they almost get a nice shot on the goal, but Chewie is gonna get a beautiful save. Beautiful save indeed. Bognog tried to make that a beautiful goal. Unfortunately, it's going to get stolen right out from him. And now Ozzy is going to be on that wall like a spider, trying to find an opportunity to jump on that fly. That's the ball. Hyper going to have to chase this one to the corner, but it's going to get demoed. Ozzy is going to be 
ready for anything here. Finding it, taking it along the wall, centering it, giving an opportunity for the team to take a shot. But Frank My Fry is there to disrupt them as much as possible. No shot will be taken, but the offense is still not let up. Bognog, but D4 Chewie is going to steal that one away. Ozzy is now trying to clear it, but facing a little bit too much pressure here. The Panthers are getting aggressive right off of their defense, but Billy Billy Gamers are able to recover. To recover, and now it looks like Billy Billy recovers even more, getting a point on their scoreboard. I mean, look at that setup from Fog Dunk, the pure speed from the side of the Hyper, and he can dunk it in there. Yes, and now Billy Billy Gamers establishing a strong lead already. 1 0 with three minutes remaining. Panthers, of course, still have ample opportunity to turn this into their favor. But uh, as we've seen in these previous games, a lot can take place in a very short amount of time. So who knows how much chaos is going to ensue in these next three minutes. Billy Billy Gamers, however, they're going to try their best to stretch out this lead that they have and turn it into an even bigger one as you can see the offense is getting stronger from Billy Billy Gamers and of course Panthers they're gonna have to strengthen the defense as a result that boost is gonna get stolen right away from him he's not gonna be able to make a play as a result but Bognog still able to maintain the pressure try to get that one centered and Oz is gonna take the opportunity but it's gonna get stolen once it's very back and forth here, Hyper, though, maintaining control for his game. But Osgood might have found an opening. They're not going to let up off the gas pedal here. They're going to keep taking shot after shot after shot. But Billy Billy going to have to be forced on the defense because of it. But now, Ozzy finds the opening, going to go for a nice shot of his own. But does not find the final shot. There's a demo coming up from Frank My Bride. That's going to be a nail in the coffin for Billy Billy. But it's not going to spend a spell the end for them just yet. As Hyper oh, and Billy wow. Billy is going to find a beautiful shot. A beautiful shot indeed. It seems that Billy Billy has found their stride. They're really doing their best to maintain that offense again and leaving no gaps in their defense. I think they've really perfected the craft right now and the Panthers are definitely going to have to make more work in order to capitalize off of any mistakes that Billy Billy Gamers make. But I don't think Billy Billy Gamers want to be making anymore. As you can see, their offense is still so strong. Bognog already charged down just like a torpedo, like we said. And it's going to get taken to the center. Hyper's already there to try to turn this into a goal. It's going to get caught in the corner. Bognog there to try to intercept. But it's going to go right over the defense. But Hyper is there to save it in the last second. V4 Chewie's taking that to the center. Frank right ready for the shot. But Bognog there to take it out of the skies, take it to the ground. And now it's a fight in the middle. Hyper is going to take this to the ceiling to try to find an opportunity to take it right down the center. Ozzy as well, now trying to keep that going over to blue side, but it's gonna find its way over to orange corner. They're gonna try to take it out, but W8 is there to maintain the pressure, taking right now to orange center, almost goes in, and they're left open, wow. but Bognog was there for the last second save. Ozzy there to try to turn it into a goal. Frank My Fry says, absolutely not on my field. Hyper is there, ready for the pass. Bognog there to try to make it happen, but with all three Panthers in the corner, the net is open. Billy Billy Gamers just have to find an opportunity to take it out of the corner and into the net fast enough. And I think Ozzy's found it with that side shot. It's going to get saved out thanks to the boost that Panthers had in their reservoir. But Bognog coming from the center. V4 Chew is there to save it. The pressure seems to be overwhelming right now for the Panthers. The Panthers, 44 seconds and counting left to get two goals. They're going to have to get two goals within 20 seconds. It's going to be an absolute crazy task to do. If anyone wants to do it, it's the Panthers already winning two games in this series. But Billy Billy looking to hold firm so far, even looking for a third goal at this point as they're not letting up on this aggression. They've mastered the attack and they've mastered the defense here. Aiden trying to gain control for his team and start the blitz where the Panthers goes over the defense, gets the setup off the backboard, and now his team is in a good position. But once again, it goes back over to Billy Billy, and they almost get a huge dunk once again, almost securing the third point. But right now, with two seconds remaining, this is going to look to be a game for Billy Billy. Billy Billy taking that last game. Uh, so 
It's. I believe that might be the series right there. Yes. That's going to be two for the Panthers, and that's going to be one for Billy Billy. So they're not going to get 3 0 They are at least going to take one game away from the series. And I think even though they came out of the series with less points, I think the adaptation that they demonstrated – was more important for how they're going to play for the rest of the tournament. They yeah. demonstrated that they are able to take some disadvantaged situations and turn it into a situation where they are coming out on top. Yeah, for sure. They played amazingly, especially in that last third game. They didn't let the Panthers get a single goal. They really upped their mm -hmm. defense to a great degree. And the Panthers, they had that amazing mindset as well in that second game. They are down so many points, but they had that 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 will to withstand the, 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 the fire yeah, the will to try and bring it back. And they, it worked out for them. They did. And you got to give props for that. Yeah. I've, I've been giving a lot of props. You got, yeah, look, <laughs> I think we've both been giving Everybody a lot of props to. because the props are due. You know, these teams deserve the props. They're earning them. You work a hard day's work. You get the props at the end of it. <laughs> and uh, again, Props to both of these teams playing so well throughout the series. Panthers coming out 2-1 over Billy Billy Gamers. But like I said, ladies and gentlemen, that's just some of the Rocket League that we have today. Of course, that was the Platinum and Below division, but we have Diamond Plus coming up next. Do you know who we have coming up next, Matthias? Yes, I do. That's going to be the Bay Ridge Blazers, and then we're also going to have the Black Panthers as their opponent. So two Panther teams as well must be a popular <laughs> mascot. <laughs> Yeah, so uh, oh, same school. Yeah, O's good. Uh, they have the Panthers and they have the Black Panthers. And then, yeah, Bay Ridge, uh, Bay Ridge Secondary School, they're going to have their team coming up next. But before we head to that series, Matthias, any final thoughts on this last one we just saw? Oh, it's just great gameplay all around. He, like, that was as good of a game of Rocket League as you want. It was very close, always within at least a few points of each other. No one really stretching the lead. And it was just. Very good. A lot of comebacks, a lot of highs and lows, and that's what you want in a good esports title. Absolutely. All kinds of competition. I always say it's entertaining, it's interesting, it's fierce when the teams are close, and I think that series kind of encapsulated it fully. Very close games, very strong competition. Couldn't ask for anything more. But, ladies and gentlemen, as we're getting ready for the next series, we're going to take a quick break, but we'll see you all very soon.